my house. Bailey. Hi. She's nervous. Um, we're going to eat. I do have my rollers in. We'll take them out on our way there because it's so gross outside that they need hold and they did not hold yesterday. So I'm nervous. But we're going to Nick and Sam's. Um which is kind of crazy. So crazy. But we're going there. We're going to Catbird for drinks and um we're just gonna get real crazy. Um you've all seen this outfit before. I don't even think I can just describe it. Everyone from Depop. We've all seen this outfit before. It's so long. Um, yeah, that's what we're doing. We tanned today. We tanned. So hot. Got Chick-fil-A and Starbucks. That's all we did today. We lived. We, bra we braved. <laughs> My friends think I'm funny. Yeah. Uh Today's Saturday, July 1st. I'm taking up my rollers. I'm about to meet Caroline. We have nothing planned today except just get drunk at dinner. We're gonna have a little like fun date night tonight. Um, we're going to Honor Bar. And I'm taking out my rollers. I can't believe it's already July. But that means my birthday is coming up. And ow. I'm gonna be 24 and that's crazy, makes you wanna throw up, but nothing I can really do, at least I don't love 24. These are the rollers I use. I try not to use the really big ones. B Real just went off and I never used B Real. My B Real is K Bigger Country Check Four. It used to be my kick name, except this time the country is C U N T. So. You're my little sparkle, jump rope queen. You're my little sparkle. It looked really bad. We're taking a retake. Okay, never mind. I hated the B Real. Um, I haven't posted a B Real in like two months, so. Yeah. Oh, okay. So I've been going at my bangs and I've been loving the way they're looking lately. I'm kind of over my bangs, I might go back, but I like them this length. Okay. I've got to go. I'm ready to put my shoes on, find those. I'm wearing just my brandy tank. I mean, I'm wearing just my brandy top and my brandy skirt and my boots that you've all seen. So let me get those on right now. Okay, we're moving and so my room is just like not there um, It's not cute, but that's okay But I am getting ready for the day. I'm not sure exactly what we're doing today But I know we're gonna do some packing and I know we're going to South Lake. I need to find a dress for um, a funeral my Mimi to pass away 
she was 92 and it was just her time to go so i'm gonna miss her forever but i don't really want to talk about that um but yeah that is what i need to find i know there's a dress that i really like from aritzia so hopefully they still have it i looked online and it's this cute little baby doll black dress i need a dress for the viewing and a dress for a saturday for the funeral so hopefully i find one if not i know i have something in my closet but i love getting new things i'm hitting this angle but that's okay I don't really, since a lot of things are packed up, I don't really have anything to prop it on. But I'm just going to do light makeup. This dark circle stuff from Caudalie, I don't really think it does much because I think I just have dark circles. Like, I think they're just genetic. And I really don't think anything's going to help. Maybe if I slept more, because I don't sleep. It takes me forever to go to bed at night, so I bet that would really help my problem. But that's okay. I think I don't really want to wear foundation when I wear foundation, and it's so hot outside, it literally makes me feel like it just makes me feel claustrophobic. So I think I'm just gonna wear like concealer and do my tanning drops. Okay, nothing is updated on my routine, so okay, I'm just gonna use my tanning drops. I'm definitely gonna have to get it. Honestly, I do have a lot left. I got this back in March. This though, I am almost out, so. I'm also filming a TikTok. Okay. I just put this on my finger. I definitely should stop putting it on my finger because it's been getting into my nails mm -hmm. and it's not cute so i should probably put the palm on my hand but i just didn't do that today but i need to do that in the future because it's been staining my fingers i don't like that see it's in my fingers right now oh my gosh i can feel it in my nail see you see that brown stuff? Gross. It's for my tanning, tanning drops. When I go to the nail place, they're like, "Did you hurt yourself?" No, it's just my, just my tanning drops. I'm just gross. Also, I don't know exactly what time we're going to South Lake, but I'm hungry, and kind of want salada because they don't have salada in Alabama. So it's kind of my last time to get it. I'm not really craving it, but like I need to eat it because I'm gonna miss it. And I've already had all the foods, not all the foods, but most of the foods that um, restaurants are not gonna have in Alabama. So, or anywhere else, I'm gonna move. So, I think I'm gonna get Salada, bring it back, eat here, and then we'll go to South Lake to go shopping. Okay, next thing I do is oh, yeah. I put on the Glossier, the Glossier Future Dew, um, Glow Queen. I love this stuff. Love it. It looks kind of cool. Okay, next, um, I think I'm just going to go on with concealer now. Or, well, primer. Actually, I don't need to use this. Okay, I'm going to go with concealer, and I use the Stay Naked um, Urban Decay Concealer in 40 and in. I've been using this for a long time, and I still love it. I still love it. I think I'm just going to blend it in with my fingers. Um, I'm really going to miss this room. For those who don't know, I am moving out of my childhood home. And my parents are selling it. And I only have just like a few more days left in this house, in this room. I've lived in this room since I was four. 
and well went to college and didn't really come home that much but still like this house has been here since I was four I'm 23 now and it's just sad like my sister left this morning and it was like our last night last night to just like be together in this house sad it's really sad but you know what life happens it's not really my decision and I just have to get with it sometimes you just have to go with it in life even if you don't want to you have to so yep I've been trying to film as much footage possible in this house too and I think I think I'm doing a good job okay we're blended I hope and now I'm just gonna put on a little bit of bronzer yeah using the Patrick Taws bronzer and she's bronzed duh and I'm just gonna spray my setting spray with it because I don't want to get up to get it wet and that's okay because it does the trick I saw on TikTok that you can open a beer bottle with an eyelash curler. And when Megan was over here, I guess like two weeks ago, we were drinking Coronas in our bed. And we were like, oh, the Baker family does not have a bottle opener because my parents don't really drink. So I was like, oh, we didn't think about that. So Megan really struggled. She ended up getting it on um, the door over there and ripping it off right here so she made it work but i saw that tiktok and i was like megan we literally could have used my eyelash curler but it's fine it already happened and it worked out but i'm gonna use that now if i don't have a beer bottle opener um mascara duh where's where'd it go where'd it go where did my mascara go i literally took it out didn't i Okay. I don't really know where it would have gone. Hello. Oh, it's right here. Found her. Now. Now I think I'm done. I literally forgot. Bronzer. What the heck? What the heck, Kaylee? Um, awesome. Okay, awesome. How did I forget this? You stupid, stupid girl. Just kidding, we love ourselves. We love ourselves. We matter. Okay. Um, that's it. That's my makeup for today. Um, yeah. We'll do our lips. We'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. Let me go get them. I get my lipstick. My Diet Coke just sitting there. Love that. She's a star. She's an icon. And a napkin. Ignore the napkin. Acknowledge the Diet Coke. Slay. Okay. I'm going to go get dressed. And I'll see you when I see you. Again, my room. Boxes, messy. Okay. The shirt, no idea where I got it from. But it's this wife beater and it was a little long, so I cut it. And it's kind of slain. And I love it. I want to get these in different colors and put rhinestones and say either like St. Bart's bitches or St. Bart's sisters or St. Bart's besties because that's where we're going for our girls trip in August and for my birthday. So I need to find a bunch of these in like pink or just like pastel colors and figure out how to put those rhinestones on there and we can wear them on the plane and be matching and be so cute. So I'm gonna put on a denim skirt and then go to Salada.
we're on our way to Salada. I'm so excited. Everyone else is gonna get canes, and I would rather have that, but actually, you know what? I need to get buckled. Um, we don't have canes in Alabama. They only have it in the Tuscaloosa um, University of Alabama um, dining. So actually, okay, shut up car. I understand. I'm understanding. Look, click, I'm clicking, I clicked, I clicked. Um, yeah, there's no canes in Alabama, really. Uh, you know, I'll get that sometime, but I'm getting Salada. I love Salada, Salada diehard fan right here. Um, Salada owners, hello, it's me. I really would like you to open a store, a restaurant, in Birmingham, Alabama, just for when I visit my family, like, please. I know you have chopped, but like, I'm just like not a chopped girl. I'll, I'll be a chopped girl for a moment but I'm always gonna be a Salada girl. And I live by that. So I'm on the way, I'm gonna jam out to some T-Swift and get crazy. So, see you when I get my salad. Here's our shining star. We love her. Okay, I'm putting my camera on the stash bar, but I don't think it's gonna stay. But, got my salada. I got a peach lemonade or a raspberry lemonade mixed with black tea. This is so gonna fall. Okay, so before I leave, which is really, really soon, um, I don't think I'll do it today, but I do kinda wanna drive by, like, just places that are really sentimental or just like trauma about where I grew up. For example, where I went to school. Most of my schools. My senior school was the best school. But, Birdville, we love Birdville. But my other schools and my private school, trauma. And maybe I'll, I need to show you guys it. I need to take you by, take you down memory lane. Even if I don't post it, I do like wanna document like all these places because I really just don't know when I'm gonna be back here. And I think that's so sad and crazy, but I think I'm holding on to just, I mean, my childhood for sure. I think I'm just trauma bond by this town. Um, this might sound so dramatic, but you know, if, you have a if you're a therapist watching this, maybe you can give me some feedback. Um, I really need a therapist and I think that's healthy for everyone. Everyone needs one. And yeah, so maybe I'm just, I have a trauma bond with my city that I grew up in but it's sad leaving. It's just weird knowing you're never gonna come back and be in your childhood home. Like, yeah, I'll come back, but I really don't think I'm gonna come back anytime soon. Maybe in like five years. I just, I don't need to come back. It's just too sad. But we'll take you some places. Like, this is the neighborhood that leading to my neighborhood. Okay, y'all don't care about that. And maybe I won't document it or post it, but at least I can drive around these sentimental places and have a moment to myself. And that is how I'm processing everything. You know, just selling my childhood home, my grandmother passing away. It's just a lot this week. And I know I never really get serious on my vlogs or just with um, social media, but this is what's happening in my life this week and this time this season trying to find a job it's just a lot and i'm sharing it with you guys maybe i'll debate on sharing this but it's okay i'm i'm a vlogger i vlog my life and this is what this is what you guys signed up for that's what you subscribed for so i'm home now and i don't want to crash my mom's car while i park so toodles 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 there she is my house, my childhood house. Okay, I have things to show you guys. Okay, went to South Lake, got some stuff. I know my clothing haul, I mentioned that I found my birthday dress, but I think what I'm about to show you will be my actual birthday dress. I'll still wear it on my trip, but let me show you. It's from Aritzia, and it was on sale. Here she is. It's so pretty, and it's $98, but I got it for $48, so I had to get it, and I got these shoes that are going to be perfect 
with this dress. Let me show you. Okay, I've already worn them, but look how cute these are. Literally perfect. Literally perfect. I think it'd be so pretty with the yellow. And it's by the brand Kaylee P. My name's Kaylee. And they have blue ones too. I have to get the blue ones. But they're perfect and we're keeping them in here so they don't get ruined during the move. But with the yellow dress, it's gonna be perfect and I'm so excited. I found this dress at Aritzia. It's an extra small. I wish they had a double extra small, but I obviously need it for the funeral on Saturday. I think it's simple and dainty, and I definitely will be wearing this a lot. I want to get it altered, though, since it is a baby doll dress and it's a little big. I want it shorter, so I'm going to do that. But since funeral Saturday, I'm not going to alter it just yet. And then I got a dress from Marissa, too. So I got three dresses from Marissa, yeah. And this one I'm going to wear for the viewing on Friday. And I was going to give it to my sister because I don't think I'll wear it again. But I actually kind of like it. So I'm going to keep it. But I just got those three things. And I'm just really obsessed with her. I'm so excited to wear it. And that's it. So I'm going to finish. My closet's like kind of empty. We have a moving box. I'm going to finish doing that and I'll keep you guys updated on what I'm doing today. Uh, but it's mostly just packing, so yeah. I just got out of the shower and the room is empty. I'm really sad right now and this is really depressing. <sighs> it's so empty. My bed used to be right there. My TV. I used to have a day bed right here. Before they painted these walls, I did write my name somewhere right here in like high school. But it's really, really depressing. And this spot right here is where I filmed all my YouTube videos in high school. I have my desk right there, my little mirror. A chair, and I put my camera where the camera's sitting right now. And that's where I filmed my first YouTube video. It's kind of cool. But I started my YouTube career right there. Oh, so sad. So sad. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.